Hello and welcome to Cheap Joe's. My name is Julie and I am here to impart some knowledge to you today via a two minute art tip. Um, art is tough. There's no two ways about it. And um, if you've been in it and around it long enough, you understand the difference between constructive criticism and just um, criticism and also just people being ignorant. Um, uh, people don't even realize when, they're, when they say stuff sometimes, like I, you, know, you get a dinner party at your house and somebody walks into your studio and goes, oh, I love that, is that a landscape? And you're like, no. Uh, and it's almost like too painful to have a discussion about, so you just politely move along. Um, and it's, you know, people come from their area of experience and have their own feelings and stuff like that. Um, and criticism is hard. It's, it's hard to process. And um, to, if you're one of the lucky people who make it to having a profession in art, um, part of that process, as much as the technique in the practice, is learning how to deal with criticism, learning how to process feedback, and good, get the good stuff out of it and, and move on. Um, and sometimes the criticism can borderline on not constructive at all, and being able to take it and process and move on is, is tough. Um, and so I wanted to share with you a couple of quotes from critiques um, and just let you know uh, about some of the things that people can say that, you know, sometimes don't have a really good place. For instance, uh, critique of a um, of famous artist merely gives the impression of being a sort of madman, painting in the state of delirium and tremens. A critique of Paul Cezanne. Schizophrenic and practically satanic. Grotesque unconcern for the beholder. A critique of Picasso in his early days. And then his paintings were formless, unfinished, and ugly. A critique of Monet um, in one of his salon exhibits. So the best of them have gotten a big fat mouthful and understand that it's part of putting yourself out there creatively. It's kind of the, the feedback um, formula that comes in, but also understand that the general public at large is clueless <laughs> and it's okay. I mean, think about it. The general public have liked such things as like thongs and circus peanuts and jelly shoes in the 80s. So like, understand your audience and understand that it's not about you personally. Um, it's about where they're coming from and that's okay. But being able to take that and be resilient and press on um, with your creativity and your endeavor to put yourself out, like, out there like that is tough. So give yourself some kudos and a little pat on the back and know that it's gonna be all right. Just keep going and enjoy your art.